Hi, I'm Morgan from Whole Latte Love. I woke up this morning and my first thought was chocolate cake latte. Man, that sounds good. So I decided we should put one together today. Here's what you'll need. A double shot of espresso, one ounce of Monin cupcake syrup, two squirts of chocolate sauce, eight ounces of steamed milk, and some chocolate whipped cream and sprinkles to top it off. So I already prepared my homemade chocolate whipped cream earlier, and making chocolate whipped cream is very simple. You just add cocoa powder to your regular ingredients for whipped cream. So I used eight ounces of heavy whipping cream, three tablespoons of cocoa powder, and a third cup of confectionery sugar. But I did mix my cocoa powder and confectionery sugar together before adding that to the whipping cream. So you just need to whip the whipping cream for about a minute, and then you slowly incorporate the cocoa powder and sugar mixture a little bit at a time. So I'm gonna be using the Gaja Brera for my double shot. And this is a popular super automatic machine that's relatively compact, so you don't need a ton of counter space, and it's very easy to use. So for the double shot, I'm just gonna press the espresso button two times. I'm using Whole Latte Love's Malabar Gold, and as you can see, the Brera produces a really from a rich shot of espresso. Okay, my shot's ready, so I'm just gonna set this over here and we're gonna steam our milk. So the first thing you wanna do is purge your steam wand. So just turn the steam knob over to steam. It's gonna get that excess water out of the steam wand. Okay. All right, now we're ready to steam our eight ounces of milk and I'm using an Espro Torrid pitcher. And the Gaja Brera does have a Panarello wand, which makes it really easy to get your steamed milk. All right, my milk is ready. Always make sure to wipe off your steam wand. So now we can put this together. The first thing I'm gonna do is add my espresso to the glass. And then just do two squirts of chocolate syrup right into that hot espresso. And then give it a stir, mix it up. All right, now I'm gonna add Monin cupcake syrup. And I'll give it another stir. Now just top it with the milk. Okay, so now we're just gonna top it with our chocolate whipped cream. So I'm just gonna add a little bit at a time because I want it to stay on top of that milk foam. And this homemade chocolate whipped cream is like the frosting on chocolate cake. It's really delicious. All right, now I'm gonna add some sprinkles. For a little color. And now I'm gonna taste it. Mm. If you are a chocolate cake lover, this latte is to die for. It really tastes like you're taking a bite of chocolate cake with that Monin cupcake syrup combined with the homemade chocolate whipped cream as the frosting. It's absolutely delicious. It's even a perfect latte to make for someone on their birthday. Again, this is the Chocolate Cake Latte, and I'm Morgan from Whole Latte Love. See you next time. Whole Latte Love is your resource for everything coffee. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for daily updates on new coffee gear, plus hundreds of videos including how-tos, equipment reviews, recipes, expert technical advice, and more.